our HSN price is a great value that we bring to you every day. We work hard and have the buying power to make sure it's a value that you'll love. So go ahead, treat yourself with the confidence to buy now at the HSN price. Customer Appreciation Month is all about you. So we're showing the love to our HSN card VIPs for the entire month of April with exclusive perks like our VIP Tuesdays. Get a special offer every Tuesday in April, plus extra flex or VIP financing on every item all month long. Not a card member? Apply now and instantly get $40 off when you're approved. Visit hsn.com slash hsn card or call 1-800-284-3100 for our exclusive VIP offers. Welcome back, everybody. Happy Easter to y'all. I'm so glad to be spending the day with you. Hi, Facebook friends. Love you guys. Hope you're having a great Easter. So this is our third hour uh, together, and I will tell you, uh, uh, what I love about our today's special is that we've done it earlier than we ever did. Uh, it's our Dynatrap, and I'm telling you, the bugs, if it's over 50 degrees where you live, they're already starting to breed. So we decided to do it early this year. It's the best way I think you can control the bugs in your neighborhood. Grab it. Here you go, our today's special. All right, here we go, everybody. And I will tell you, you will absolutely love it. We're gonna put our correct graphic up for you. Here it comes. It's called Dynatrap, okay? It is the perfect time to prepare. If you wanna enjoy your springtime, summertime, and fall, the last thing you wanna be doing is coating yourself with toxic chemicals from just, just to avoid those nasty biting insects. What type of insects are we talking about? Mosquitoes, noceums, gnats, hornets, wasps, moths, you know the kind, the kind that drive you nuts when you're out there trying to enjoy a barbecue or trying to have a cookout with your family. Well, how about if I told you, you're gonna be able to control that population. And here's the thing about, about we'll just bring up mosquitoes for one, right? The, the female mosquito lays about one to 200 eggs every single day. So once you have a mosquito, a female out there, and they're in your neighborhood, within a matter of time, you're gonna have 201 mosquitoes out there, and then they're gonna have more mosquitoes. So what it's about is controlling the population <clears throat> in a way that's a humane way. And that's what Dynatrap does. Let me show you the bugs, first of all, that it's gonna work on. And it uses a UV attractant light and that carbon dioxide, which it gives off just like humans do. So that's what really draws the bugs in. If you don't love mosquitoes, if you hate flies, wasps, hornets, stink bugs, moths, right? Flapping around your candles, biting midges, Beetles, gnats, blowflies, drainflies. I don't even know what a musket is, but it scares me. It's the dastardly musket, but I'm sure it bites, right? Or we wouldn't put it up there. It takes care of all those. How? It basically draws them in with a little bit of a vacuum, the UV light, and that scent that it puts out, which is the same scent that humans put out, which is that carbon dioxide gas. I have three choices you can choose from. For the first time ever, we have a half acre available. All right, and I've got a bunch of colors. I'll get to that in a sec. But the half acre is perfect if you have a small yard, apartment, condo, right? You're going to be killing those bugs every single day. In fact, you're going to get a half acre, about 2,000 bugs a week you're going to get rid of, right? If you get the full acre, it's close to 3,000 bugs a week that are not going to be flying around your yard. And bugs are territorial, especially mosquitoes. They stay within a one-acre place. So you're, you've got the same mosquitoes biting you day after day. That's how you can get rid of it. So our pricing, half acre, quarter acre. Dynatrap has a website, OK? I'm going to show you our price. And Dynatrap works with us. They gave us a great one-day-only price. So for the quarter acre, HSN's price is $39.95. If you get it at Dynatrap, it's $104. Okay, that's a what, $65 difference. If you want to get the half acre, they're doing it $174. We're doing it at $79. $79. That's a $95 difference. If you get the one acre, look at our price for one acre. $129 versus $284. We're less than 50 or more than 50% off the retail price that they sell it on Dynatrap.com. And how does it work? Plug it in. That's it. See these over here? I just plug them in. All right, that's all you need to do. And it starts going to work for you, okay? Now, they have that UV bulb built in there. That will last you year after year after year. 
okay? We say on average, they can last anywhere, depending on where you live, from like one to two seasons up to four seasons, and Peter will explain that as well. But get it home. I love that it's easy, no toxic chemicals, no sprays. Put it about 30, 40, 50 feet away from where you're enjoying your day or night, and let the bugs be gone. Peter Kukulin standing by, he's our special guest. Hey, Pete. Hey, guy. I mean, an amazing day, and as you mentioned, the best Dynatrap that they've ever developed and the best time of year to get it. As you mentioned, as soon as you feel it's starting to be above 50 degrees and that starts to feel good and we're thinking about going outside, well, those biting insects are also knowing that it's 50 degrees and they're gonna start moving around looking to bite someone who's enjoying the outdoors. So this Dynatrap is really the perfect time to get it home and get it working, not just repelling bugs that are attempting to bite you, but, but trapping them. We're not zapping, we're gonna trap those, uh, you said mosquitoes, Guy, mosquitoes are the worst problem in my yard, but it's all those other bugs that you mentioned as well, the no seams and the gnats, things like that, it's gonna do a great job. So Guy, let's talk about that technology that makes this so amazing, how it's safe, it's silent, it's super simple to use, all of those things make it a zero maintenance, great way to take care of those biting insects. So here's how we're gonna do it. We're gonna do it with light, we're gonna do it with warmth, and we're gonna do it with carbon dioxide. So let's get in here and I'll show you this light. You know Harry there, he's behind the camera. He's gonna zoom in on that attractive glow UV LED bulb. This is the best one they've ever developed, scientifically developed to be the one that attracts the most biting insects, and it will last 27 months. So if you're using it continuously, it's 27 months. But if you're using it at different times, uh, just a four or five months a year, you have several seasons, maybe four different seasons you'll be able to use it before replacing that. So the bowl brings them in, it creates the warmth, and then we're gonna heat up this um, titanium plate and create that carbon dioxide. And I'll show you that. So all of those things bring them in, and then this huge fan is gonna suck them down into that collection basket where they are going to stay forever. So check this out, guy. I think that's the cool thing, that everyone understands that we're gonna bring them in. But we normally associate that blue light with zapping and the mess, and you talked about the burning moths when we were talking earlier. But here, it's the fan that's just gonna draw them in. Look at that, that powerful fan. So they get drawn in, they get curious, they think they're about to bite someone, warm-blooded, right? Because they need to do that to reproduce, but we're gonna just vacuum them down into that collection basket. So that's the difference. All this technology together makes this the great way to not repel, but to really start to trap and reduce that population. And the ones that are biting are the females, guy. You know that. Yeah. So they're the ones we're trapping. So now they can't reproduce. <laughs> so one mosquito that was gonna be 200 more mosquitoes, we're trapping that one. And then we're trapping another one and more and more and you're gonna be able to go outside because you're not gonna be just constantly eaten by those bugs. If it's mosquitoes like me, or those no seams, whatever it is, this Dynatrap you is know, amazing. Peter, you know, when you, when you decide to have a cookout or a pool party or a barbecue right. or a birthday party for your kids, we often don't think about that, right? We're like, oh, we're having a party. Well, who's going to bring the chicken? Who's bringing the Chick-fil-A? Who's, you know, who's doing all that stuff? Uh, make sure the kids bring their suits and towels. And then the kids get, or, or, the, or the grown ups get to your party, and now it's like, oh my gosh, did anybody bring bug spray? Oh my God, oh my gosh, I'm getting right. eaten alive. And a lot of people, and I, I know a lot of women in, that are there in my life, my mom, my son's girlfriend, Lily, her mother, uh, you know, when I'm with them, they're like, oh my gosh, the, the bugs eat me alive. And I don't know if it's blood type, I don't know what it is, but I know certain people really have an issue with it. That can ruin your whole night, right? I mean, if you're going camping, I think the only time we really think about bugs is when we go camping. But we, we live in, in a world of bugs and insects. They're the most popular, uh, you know, uh, thing on our planet is bugs, right? I don't want to get rid of all of them. I just don't want to live with them in my yard, especially while I'm having a cookout or a barbecue or having friends over, because literally, Lily, when she comes over, I mean, when she, I have one now, it's not as bad, and it's not even close. But when she used to first come over a few years ago when Danny and her were first dating, she wouldn't go out on the patio after four o'clock because her little ankles would get eaten alive by gnats. Now, between that, and I also use my No More Bugs, my spray, which, which is uh, we, we offer here, which I love. Between that combination, the bulk of the bugs are being eliminated by the Dynatrap. And if I got a few left over, I don't mind using a natural spray that we sell, you know, if I want to use that, because I love that stuff. But I've, I have basically turned a really 
kind of a crappy evening into a really good evening, right? Because I've controlled what can ruin the whole night, which is everybody slapping mosquitoes off their neck and their back. And if you've got little ones, is there anything worse than like a four or five year old getting stung by a mosquito like on their cheek? And little kids don't even realize they got bugs on them, right? Because they're too busy playing. Put this in a corner of a yard, plug it in and enjoy. And, and here's the thing, you got 30 days to try this. Get one of the sizes home. I've got them down there. There's the quarter acre, there's the half acre, there's the large one, okay? Whatever yard you want. There's the small one. So if you live in an apartment or, or uh, you know, or, or a condo, perfect, get a small one. If you live in a larger place, get a medium. Big place, get a large. You can always get two small or two medium. It's totally up to you, depending on how your yard is set up. Try it out. You're gonna be like me in a week. You're gonna go out there and you're gonna open up that tray and you're gonna see hundreds of bugs, hundreds of mosquitoes that would have kept that chain. They would have made more baby mosquitoes, more and more, hundreds every day. Instead, you've gotten rid of those and you did it in a humane way. Hit the button, put it on your garden, just mulch them into your garden. All right, it's good for your garden anyway, but get them home. That's the average of how many bugs are disposed of in a week. With the acre, 2,900 on average, seven days. With the half acre, 2,500 bugs. That's a pile of bugs, okay? And, I, and listen, if, if you're getting attacked by two dozen, three dozen mosquitoes a night, I don't know what the average is. Think about how many mosquitoes 2,500 is in a week. So you are actively getting rid of those mosquitoes in your neighborhood. And Peter, you're the one that taught me that mosquitoes especially, they're territorial. They don't, they don't go like a mile away. They stay in your yard, right? Oh yeah, those are, those are your mosquitoes. And if you don't do something about it, you know, they're just gonna stay there. So if we think about a lot of these other methods, maybe we think we're just gonna repel them a little bit and they're in the neighbor's yard, but as soon as that all stops, they kind of come back. This is gonna actively reduce the amount of bugs that you have in your yard by trapping them. So, Guy, we were talking about that we've got the light and the warmth and the carbon dioxide to bring them in. We're trapping them where they suck them down with that fan. But here's the really neat part about it. Dynatrap also developed the perfect way to use your Dynatrap to make sure that being outside is great. So it means we're not going to put it right where I am, around our table or where we're eating or where we're relaxing. We're going to put it away from that. So we can see over there, I've got the graphite, <clears throat> one acre, hanging over there. So you can see it's 30 to 40 feet away. That's where you want it because now we're going to draw all the bugs away from where we're eating, where we're spending time, draw them over there, trap them, and then we're not going to have to worry about them. But here's the other thing about it. When you get it, you want to put it three to six feet off the ground, which is really important. That's the fly zone for those biting insects. But number one is plug it in and run it 24 hours a day. Because imagine, you know, when you spray yourself with the chemicals or you put the candles out, they're not doing anything when you're not out there. But this Dynatrap, 24 hours a day, especially at night where it does its best work, is trapping mosquitoes while you're sleeping, while you're at work. All week long, it's doing the most to reduce that population. So run it 24 hours a day. The, the, the full acre costs less than eight cents a day to run. That half acre and the quarter acre, less than two cents a day to run. So I, I can't stress that enough. You want to be successful and have a great time outdoors. Running this 24, 24 hours a day is the way to go. And then the other part, I know immediately people say, yeah, but what do I have to do every day? What do I have to buy to make it keep working? What do I have to add to it? Nothing. Zero maintenance. I want everyone to get it home, plug it in, run it 24 hours a day, check it 30 days later. You'll see the bugs. You'll see that it's working. You'll be enjoying outdoors. But you don't have to do anything. Even emptying it, which is brand new this season, that bottom emptying, one touch of a button. But you're not going to have to do that every day, every week, even every month. It really depends on your bugs. And when it's time to do it, you mentioned it, Guy. It is super easy. So yeah. I can't think of a better combination of that technology and how to use it to make sure that you are going to be bug-free yeah this summer. You know what I love too, Peter, is that we're doing the quarter acre this year. 
I think that's brilliant right. because we, we had a lot of people last year that were on the fence about spending the money on the half acre because they didn't have a lot of property. And they're like, well, yeah, maybe I just, I just, I'll just put it off. Um, we are doing the quarter acre so we can take care of everybody. Even those people that live in apartments or condos. Like, look at my mom. My mom has no, I mean, she's in a condo, but she doesn't have a yard, right? It's a community association, but she does have a screen porch. So she could put it in the corner of the porch because mosquitoes will go right through the screen, especially, you know, see them and she could control them that way. So honestly, we, we have lots of choices. I wanna go through the colors. I know we, we have a long presentation, so I didn't rush right into it. Um, I will tell you, the, the only uh, ones that we're sold out of right now is the quarter acre in the forest, all right? But if you want black, 200 in the quarter acre left in black. Stone, 300 left in the quarter acre. I'm okay in every other color. Remember, we have the stone, we have the forest, we have the, uh, the graphite. Did I miss any of them? Is that it? Let me see, hold on. No, I think there's, there's five. Graphite, bronze. We also have it available in the bronze, all right? And remember that the, uh, the bronze and the forest and the graphite, you can only get here. A lot of you are noticing a difference from last year in the design. We decided uh, with Dynatrap, they said, you know what, we're gonna give you an exclusive floral, kind of a mesh pattern on the bottom to make it a little more decorative because God's honest truth, if you see this on a shepherd's hook in the corner of somebody's yard, you're just gonna think it's a lantern. It doesn't look like a bug zapper because it's not a zapper. It's a bug trap, okay? Zapping, don't get me wrong, and I've, I said it in my first airing, when I was a kid, that was the fun that we'd be like, oh my gosh, listen to that zap. The problem is they're dirty, they're nasty. If you get a moth in one of those things, it burns for like a minute and a half. And that's really kind of gross for most people. Uh, you know, we were little kids and we thought it was funny, but then poor dad had to go there with a screwdriver and pick a dead moth out. You don't have to deal with that. Everything gets trapped, and I'll have Peter show you again that the suction of how it gets trapped in when he has time, he can show you that. But basically, it's three different things, okay? It's the ultraviolet light, which insects are attracted to. Anybody that's driven by a street light or see, there, any kind of light insects are attracted to, but especially UV. The next thing is the carbon dioxide, which is what humans give off. They replicate that in the machine so that the bugs think it's a person. So they're going to eat something, right? The last thing is that suction, which pulls it in the little trap door where it is uh, humanely just dies of its, of its natural causes inside there because it's not eating, right? And it suffocates. So, and then all you do is hit one button to dump it out into your mulch or into, into your dumpster. I, I put it back in the yard. Let nature take care of nature. Recycle, right? Thank you, Peter. What's going on there, Pete? Yeah, that, that's what happens when, you, as you just described, when those biting insects get too close, they think they're about to bite, you or I, and then they get sucked in by that fan down into that collection basket. So you can see that's what we're doing. So normally we used to think of, you just described it, that horrible zapping and the smell and the noise, but not anymore. We're trapping. We're going to bring them down into that collection basket. So that's the big difference. So we're, we're bringing them in with those three different attractants the warmth the light and then also that carbon dioxide that we're producing but then it's just that suction that brings them down so whether it's the the full acre the half yeah. or the quarter they all operate the same way now guy we I, I always like to talk about how we decide what size yeah, might yeah. be best for us so certainly on the area of your yard that's why we're saying acre half and a quarter but i also think let's think about how large of a problem you have the larger your problem with bugs then maybe go for a larger size yeah. and not just focus on the area. So I have the full acre back here, certainly not an acre in my backyard, but I think that I've got a massive mosquito problem. Sure. I get bit like nobody right. else. So I went with the full acre. If you have a front porch and a backyard like I do, maybe you go for two half acres. Sure. So you're covered in the front. Because if you have a full acre in the back and then your house is blocking the entire front, it's not gonna really be able to cover the front as well because that's gonna be a bit of a barrier with the house in between. So two half acres, smaller areas, maybe a garage, that yeah. balcony, that workshop, <clears throat> this quarter acre is gonna be perfect for that as well. And I think you mentioned it earlier, or maybe you have two small areas or maybe it's yeah. on either end of a, of a larger wraparound porch kind of area, maybe two quarter acres are good for that. So the size of the area, but don't uh, forget about the size of your problem sure. because that can really tell you to bump up to a bigger one to make sure you can tackle that problem for the I whole I would summer. say also, Peter, it might be a good idea to go to the, to the uh, full acre if you live near a lake 
or near a river sure. or a stream because oh, we all yeah. know breeding areas for bugs are usually st uh, standing water. And uh, and by the way, that's a great tip if you, uh, you know, since we're a gardening show, uh, if you've got your uh, potted plants and they have a liner underneath that, um, it's, a, it's a good idea in bug season to put a hole in the liner as well because you do not want to have standing water, even on your plants, okay? Because, and I know that, you know, you're trying to keep the water from dripping around, but it's a good idea. Look around your yard. Make sure you have no, obviously, tire tubes or things like that laying around where mosquitoes love to nest. But realistically, just put one of these out in your yard. And by the way, um, I want to mention something, too. We, we haven't even talked about the HSN credit card. If you get a new credit card today, take another $40 off any one of these, which means quarter acre is free. With a brand, if you get a new credit card, you've never used it before, you use it today, they're going to give you 40 bucks. That covers the $39. You'll have to pay a little tax and a little shipping. Uh, but the shipping is minimal, especially on that on that quarter acre. So get that home. But take the forty dollars off any one of these. Okay, you'll absolutely love it. There's the small quarter acre, and the half, and the large uh, full acre. We want to show you the size difference. But remember, the the technology is the same on all three. Real quick, we have a couple of things that we're also offering, uh, which is the shepherd's hook. I always tell people to get it because everybody's like, ah, I'll hang it wherever I want. Then they get it to their house and like, where are we going to hang this thing? We have a shepherd's hook that stakes into the ground so that you can put this thing anywhere, all right? Information right there on the screen. It's only 22 bucks. There's a hook on top of your Dynatrap that just hooks right on the end, and now you can put that. And remember, Peter will give you some idea of where to put it uh, when we go back to him. But I always say, keep it away from you and your party. You want to keep it at least 40, 50 feet away so that the mosquitoes go there. If you have a small front yard and a small backyard, you could do a half acre, a quarter acre in either one. You get two of those, right? If you've got one big area, like my brother, Darren, he's got like probably two and a half acres in his backyard with a swimming pool. Now, he may want to put two half acres there on either side of the pool, right? Or he might want to put a full acre way out in the yard and a half acre up on his, uh, near his deck. You can figure that out. Peter will kind of talk about that a little bit more as we go. 12,300 people have picked this up today. Uh, it's so successful. And what you want to be able, I want you to take a good look at Peter and myself right now. Look at us. <laughs> all right? Do you want to Do you want to spend, first of all, you'll notice there is a difference in skin color. Peter, we got to get you out in the sun. The next thing you'll notice, although we both look amazing what? in our blue shirt. <laughs> but Pete, <laughs> Peter, what are we not doing? We're not doing this. We're not doing this. Exactly. Relaxing. Exactly. And I like guy that we don't have to prepare to go outside. We don't have to think about, well, what do we got to do? Do we have to spray? Do we have to get those <laughs> candles and light them? You don't have to do any of that because I have the Dynatrap just behind me there on the Shepherd's Hook and it's running 24 hours a day. So I don't have to worry about it at all. I can just come outside. I should have some lemonade or something out here with me and just start to relax. That's what the great weather is all about. That's why you've spent all this time and money in getting your outdoor area, you know, perfect so you can spend time out there the only thing that can send you back inside is those bugs biting you and making it just miserable to be outside but let this run 24 hours a day that's probably most important get it home you've got 30 days to really test it out prove it to yourself but run it 24 hours a day and you'll see the difference and then the best part is after that when you know it's working is you never have to think about it again if you have the full acre honestly i can't imagine that you would even have to attempt to empty that It'd be months, literally months, that you would never, ever have to even go out and take a look yeah. at it. Remember, leave these outside all weather. They're, they're perfect in the weather. You're set to go. You don't have to do anything. And, Guy, I've tried all those other methods where you have to constantly update and add more and buy yeah, more. Oh, yeah. I forgot to go to the store and replace that. 30 days, you have to do this. Every two weeks, you have to do this. Nothing. Not with Dynatrap. The best technology, the yeah. best kind of how to use it placement, and then forget about it. And while I'm sitting here, you know, pretty close to it, I have it a little bit closer sure, today sure. for the show, but it's it's silent. I don't hear it. Yeah. I don't smell anything. There's no chemicals. There's nothing at all except yeah. I can hear the birds. I can. It's just it's and Peter, perfect to be outside when it's running. You said pennies a day, right? That's right. Uh, full acre is less than eight cents a day, and wow. the other two, quarter and a half acre, are going to be less than two cents a day to run. So it's so worth it to run a 24 hours a day. That's two dollars and forty cents a month for the for <laughs> two dollars and forty <laughs> cents a month. Is it worth it for you? Do you want to be slapping bugs around all day, or you want to spend? That's on the big one. The other one, the, the small one, two cents a day, sixty cents a month, right? 
That means if you use it for six months, you're, you're, spending, you're spending a few dollars. Not even that, all right? To be able to take care of your property. And, and you know, I've, I've, I've always been a little bit leery uh, because I see the companies here in Florida that come and spray. I'm like, yeah, but now I've sprayed all the, all my my garden, right? My, my trees, my flat, my, all that stuff, my palm trees are all getting sprayed with a chemical that's gonna kill bugs. And I know they say it's safe on your plants, but then, I, you know what, why do that? And, and you know, that's, you, do you know how much it costs to spend money on getting your uh, property sprayed? It's a heck of a lot more than a Dynatrap, I can tell you that right now, okay? And then there's maintenance that goes along with that. What Peter referred to before, which was brilliant, is the fact that you saw him sitting there in his chair. The only work he did was he ordered one. That's it. And plugged it in, all right, and hung it. That's it. Once you do that, you don't touch it. And Peter also mentioned, you never turn this off during bug season. You have to understand it works round the clock to rid yourself of the population. You, you, you're not, remember, it only costs pennies a, a day. So it's not worth turning it off and then allowing some of those bugs to come back when you're sleeping. So this works around the clock. And, don't, and by the way, the insects don't go to sleep. All right, they may rest, but they don't, they're, they're not like, oh, it's daytime, we're gonna go hide. I know they're more prevalent at night when the temperature is cooler, but let me just tell you, if I'm outside working in my garden in the middle of the afternoon, I got in, I can see mosquitoes coming after me because they're sensing that carbon dioxide, they're sensing your sweat, and they're sensing a meal. I wouldn't blame them, I'd come after me too. I mean, it's a free meal. Let them go somewhere else. Control the population in your area, okay? So let me go through the price. We're gonna bring up what Dynatrap charges for these on their website, all right? They gave us one day, and we teamed up with them. They're friends of ours. And they said, well, tell you what, we know you're such a good customer of ours, and we have a great relationship. One day, because it's early, we know a lot of people are gonna balk and be like, oh, I'm gonna wait till July when I'm already getting bitten, which is stupid. I, I don't mean to call you stupid. Just, it's not wise. Get it now. So the, uh, our today special, is $39.95 for the quarter acre. If you get the, uh, the, the uh, bite at Dynatrap, it's 104 bucks, okay? Half acre, 79 here, 174 there. If you get the full acre, they're charging 284, we're charging 129 for one day only. You can use FlexPay. If you get a new credit card, you can get $40 off any of those prices. Uh, we've reduced the shipping. All you gotta do is pick a color, that's the bronze. Comes available in stone. <clears throat> There's the forest green. There's a stone next to it. It also comes in a graphite black. The only ones that I don't have is I don't have it in the forest green, the quarter acre, and the graphite black in the, uh, in the quarter acre is also ready to sell out, I think. Now, which one? Stone. 190 left in the black and 250 left in the stone, that's in the quarter acre. I'm okay on the other sizes if you wanna pick those up. If you wanna get a look at the size of it, there it is. It's how big the big one is, okay? It's about two feet tall. Goes probably about, about the same, uh, maybe a little bit larger uh, going in, around in, di uh, in a circle. You hang it from that shepherd's hook, you plug it in, get yourself an extension, plug it in, and never deal with it again. I mean, literally with the large one, like Peter said, you don't even have to empty it all summer because it's got a big enough trap in there to hold all the bugs all summer. You're gonna want to, because it's fun to do, and it's fun to see that your, that your investment is paying off. But I'm telling you, Pete, get this thing home. He, now, for those of you that maybe have a weak stomach, Peter's gonna show you exactly what's inside when you check it at the end of the month. Go ahead, Pete. Yeah, this is, again, I know we have a couple of studies that we Yuck. can show the graphics for those, <laughs> but, but here, again, this is just two weeks. Now, these, were, these weren't done by me. I have another jar of my own, but this, this is two weeks, I believe, uh, outside Chicago. And again, it's just an expectation of what this can do. It can work. I mean, the studies that were done show thousands of bugs collected in seven days. So it's amazing the results that you're going to get. So this is really, again, an example, get it home see what you can capture trap in 30 days and then you'll know that you're set for the rest of the summer because you just keep that running 24 hours a day and yeah it is kind of fun when you know and you, that these are not biting you not available yeah. to bite anyone in the family anymore it's it's satisfying to know hey this is really working the technology that we talked about that light that uv light that's going to last 27 months that's working along with the warmth and producing that carbon dioxide all of that drawing you in and well not you guy but the bugs and then 
really just trapping them down in there with that fan, vacuuming them, them in, that they're not going to bite anymore, that it really works. When you place it in that right area, away from where you're yeah. outside, if you run it 24 hours a day, you're going to have that same kind of success. It really works. And it does it, <clears throat> you know, kind of simple, silent, yeah. and it's safe. I mean, it's the perfect you way know, <clears throat> to make sure that you enjoy outside. Yeah, and there, here's an idea of how you can uh, put it up. We recommend uh, that you place it three to six feet above the ground. And then it's up to you. Everybody's right. property is different. But I would put it, like we said, 20, 30, 40 feet away from people. You want the bugs to be drawn to it, not where the people are. And this will be much more of an attractive place for them to go than to people because it, it, it exacerbates that that's that scent and everything else uh, we also have an attractant that you can pick up separately we'll show you that a little bit later but the bottom line is is that you're going to eliminate those bugs for the most part okay you may have a couple of stragglers but my issue is not one mosquito my my issue is when i've got company outside like when lily comes over danny's girl and she doesn't want to be outside because there's so many no biting her ankles right you don't want to deal with that. And by the way, you know we're streaming live on Facebook. Again, I apologize to my Facebook friends. Just way too hectic to try to monitor Facebook while I'm doing this crazy show today. Uh, but we are giving away a $25 gift card for what's your most hated bug? What's the one that drives you the most crazy? Is it a mosquito, a gnat, no see -em? Uh, stink bugs, what, what is it? You'll win $25 if we pick your answer today. So anyway, there it is right on the bottom of the screen. Get this thing home. Uh, I, I can't think of an easier way, Peter, to control the problem. In fact, I've seen these types of machines and units in some of the best hotels, right? When they have an outdoor gathering area, they put these things up, people that do weddings, right? They, they, these things, you see them in places where commercial, you know, people are doing their business because they can't have those events ruined. And, I, and you know, a, a, you know, a, an outbreak of mosquitoes or no seams can ruin anybody's party. It can ruin a wedding, outdoor wedding, and you forgot to get some of these. Here's the bugs it works on. Mosquitoes, flies, wasps, even, <laughs> you know, even hornets, oh, right? Yeah. Let me tell you, I've been stung by hornets. I got, I, I went into a, a buddy of mine's, oh, grandpa's old uh, broken down truck that he hadn't driven in years. We shut the door and it was a wasp nest inside. We each got stung about eight times. It was terrible. So wasps, um, we, we talk about the rest of the bugs that were on that list. If you want to take care of them, gnats. You know what I think my worst is? Because mosquitoes don't bother me so much. I don't like flies. I hate, and that, that includes horse flies. I do not like flies and I don't like no seams. Honestly, I'm not really sure what a musket is, but I'm sure that packs a mean punch as well. The dreaded, elusive, but angry musket. It's a bug as well. I didn't even know it was a bug. Peter, have you ever heard of a musket? Of course. What is yeah, it? Is it here they're, in Florida, Pete? savage. <laughs> no, I really savage haven't. Savage musket. <laughs> All right. Anyway, no, go ahead, Pete. So these, you know what's funny, guy, about all those those bugs that you're seeing? There's many more biting insects sure. that would be attracted to the Dynatrap. Those are the ones that have been tested that it definitely works on. So, again, and every year they're, they're testing more and more specific different types of biting insects that are attracted to this. But if the, if the insect that's not on that list is one that's in your yard, that doesn't mean it's not going to attract that as well and do a great job on that. Those are just the ones that have been tested, just like we did those tests, those seven day and 14 day tests and show how many bugs it's trapped. It does, it works on many others. And brand new, I wanted to mention it again, is that this is the first time, well, first time we've had the quarter acre, and but the first time that all three of these now have that one touch of a button, bottom empty. And so when you've collected all those mosquitoes, those gnats, those no seams, all you do is one touch, the bottom drops out, and you can get rid of that. So there's no touching those dead bugs. It's not, you know, you're not getting close to them. It makes it super easy to empty. And again, the few times that you have to empty this, you may have to empty the quarter or the half a little bit more because they're a little bit smaller, but they're still doing a great job at bringing in all those biting insects. But you are going to love this because you're not going to have to think about it on a weekly or a monthly basis. We keep yeah. stressing that. Get it home, <clears> test <throat> it for yourself. Plug it in and let it run 24 hours a day. And the technology that Dynatrap has developed will do the rest. They won't just repel bugs. We're not going to zap. We're going to trap. But we're yeah. reducing the, the female bugs, the mosquitoes, for example, that are going to reproduce and make more mosquitoes. We're going to make sure that doesn't happen. Reduce that population means fewer biting insects in your yard. And it means having a much better time being outside. Yeah. If you're like me, I get bit a ton. 
guy's making excuses because he doesn't get bit. I'm not sure why. I'm too manly, but, uh, Peter. I think you... it's just I'm too manly. I don't know I, what it I is. I can't doubt that. <laughs> <laughs> I can't. I think but it's blood type, but I don't know. Bit, yeah, yeah I know. It, it could be. Yep. But you know the person in your family who just oh my gets gosh. a terrible Everybody. time every time yeah. they go outside. Yep. Do it for them. I mean, get it for that person. If it's you, definitely do it. Yeah, listen, uh, there is nothing worse than struggling with bugs. And you know what? I'll, I'll be honest with Peter. It's, it's, it's really just mosquitoes. Um, gnats and things like that, they still drive me. Flies, black flies, all that stuff, they drive me nuts. Oh, and, it's, yeah. and so what we've got is a multi-pronged attack to be able to get rid of all those things. You can see we're almost at 13,000 of these spoken for. We're going to be there before the end of the show, uh, probably before the end of this, uh, even at the end of this airing. But get them home, all right? We have a better price than Dinah trap by by almost 50 percent they gave us a one-day deal because it's early in the season get it now we've got extra bulbs available and they're the extra bulbs are like 15 20 dollars so that so that in three or four years when you got to change the bulb you got a bulb we have the shepherd's hook so you can hang it as well you know i i told you earlier and i'm, I'm god's honest truth which is between Dynatrap and my No More Bugs, which is also a type of repellent, which is a, a earth-friendly repellent because it has cedar oil. Between these two items, I never worry about bugs. I never, I won't see them. And the one or two that get near me, I've got the, you know, I've got the, I've got the No More Bugs on me. I, I am covered. It's a little bit of effort, little bit, tiny bit, that can really pay off. And then the, the easiest part is to get yourself a Dynatrap, all right? Because now, you're already lessening by a huge amount the number of bugs on your property. You can't get rid of every one. There might be one or two that are gonna come around, but it's better one or two than three or 400, right? We just went over, look, we just went over 13,000 gone. I got a couple minutes left. Peter, if you wouldn't mind, will you kind of start us at the top and kind of go through, I'd, I'd love to find out, I'd just see how it works again, uh, what size yeah. we should use while we still got a couple of minutes left. Yeah, let's do that. Again, let's let's focus on that bulb first thing, that we have that UV LED bulb. So if we come right in here, Harry, you with me? There he goes. You can see that bulb. That's gonna last 27 months. Scientifically developed to attract more bugs than ever, to bring them in, to create the warmth, to heat up that titanium plate, to create carbon dioxide, which is what we exhale and that's what brings in all the bugs around us so these bugs think that they found someone where they can get that blood that they're looking for and bite but what's going to happen is as they get curious and get close this powerful fan draws them down into that collection basket so you can see that pulling in those bugs as they get close and things like the no seams and the and the gnats and those mosquitoes i mean they're not strong flyers right they're going to get drawn right in there and that's where they're going to stay so that's how the technology works it makes it easy there's no chemicals all three of these are on it's virtually silent so it's safe as well but here's what we're going to do we're going to put it over there we're going to put it away from us 30 to 40 feet away shepherd's hook is perfect and let it run 24 hours a day. That's the secret because it's reducing the population of biting insects in your yard while you're sleeping, while you're at work. When it's time to go outside, there's nothing to think about. Just go outside and enjoy this summer. I mean, it's the best way to have a fantastic summer. I, I think so too. And, and you know what, it's, it's that little, what we call, you know, the, the uh, ounce of prevention, right? You wanna, you wanna make sure oh, yeah. that you're set up. You wanna enjoy your summer. Uh, I mean, we are, look at, look where we are right now, right? We are moving along and it's hard to believe that, that Christmas was like four months ago, right? It, it, it goes so quickly and May will be here before you know it. Uh, we are at Easter. I mean, gosh, this year is already going by quick. The bugs are coming. I said before, if it's 50 degrees or above, you know, Peter talked about that in his show uh, earlier in the morning. He's saying, you know, it's 50 degrees above. Your bugs are already starting to come out. They're already starting to multiply. All right. One mosquito, female mosquito, 100 to 200 eggs at a pop. So it doesn't take long for you to have thousands, hundreds of thousands of mosquitoes or gnats or noceums in your yard. Get one of these, control the population. You'll absolutely love it. Three sizes, quarter acre, half acre, or one acre. If you're concerned about what size, I would always go up, all right? The half acre is a good middle of the road. If you need more than one, take advantage of that. It's a one day where we're about 50%. We are about 50% if you average them out off the Dynatrap.com website. I have to say goodbye to my good friend, Peter Kilcullen, but uh, he's my good friend. I'm sure I will see him again. You have a wonderful day. Continued success, Peter, with Dynatrap. <laughs> Thanks, guy. Appreciate it. I'll see you soon. All right, my bro. Be good. 079609 is the item number there. I have to mention something. You remember the uh, pressure washer from before? 
Well, if you thought that was great, all right, I gotta show you, one of our most successful outdoor decor items is our home and garden color-changing shimmering chandelier. We offer this every day of the week for $44.95. Look at the price today. It is absolutely beautiful. Uh, it's got uh, an LED light inside that color changes at night. It has a built-in timer. It goes on for four hours, then shuts off for 20 hours. So turn it on at nine, goes off at midnight. It is absolutely beautiful. I'm gonna walk over to this one if you guys don't mind. And I wanna show you how the size of it. It is hundreds and hundreds of little crystal shells and little mirrors. Absolutely beautiful. It's completely assembled when you buy it at night. It lights up and it sparkles. It's like a boutique gorgeous chandelier for $20. Order a couple. You're gonna wanna give this as gifts, okay? We'll never have this low price again. Look at how beautiful it is when that wind starts to hit it. Gorgeous. Do I have any pressure washers left, Jared? 500 pressure washers available. The most popular item in my three hours. Why? Well, outside of the Today Special, why? Because you see that price? First of all, see that, see that offer? 2,100 PSI for 134.95. Look at the real price, it's 101. All right, we, we, we didn't get time to change the price on our graphic on TV, but it's 101. I paid $150 for my 1,600 PSI, and it didn't come with a four-year warranty. It didn't come with the scrub brush. Show the scrub brush. That's the best, oh! <clears throat> if you've got pa pavers, patio, sidewalk, it comes with all that. It's $101 with free shipping and a four-year warranty. And it's Sunjo number one brand. Oh my gosh. I, 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 you said there's some left, Jared. How many left? All right, I still have time to get one. 500 left, still have time to get one. All right, what am I doing next? Where am I going? Oh, brand new. I've never seen this. This is brand new in our garden. Uh, it is uh, called our Spin Tiller Multifunction Landscaping Tool. I gotta tell you, if you're a gardener and you have soil or weeds, you need to get one of these things. I, this is the first time I've aired it. It's brand new, only airing of the day. I have very few of these. I think I have 500 of these. That's it. This only weighs three pounds. What it does is it weeds, it aerates, it also dresses your mulch, it spot seeds, it does all these wonderful things just by rolling it. It is heavy gauge iron construction with an extra long wooden handle. There are two row, rows of, uh, of those uh, little, uh, basically, uh, tines that go in your soil. Come back to me, I wanna show you how it works live, okay? And it comes with a lifetime warranty. So what you wanna do, and I, I, I'm gonna stand kinda of, kind of a corner here. See how this soil right here is all packed, right? Right in that area. What you wanna do is you wanna take it and you wanna work it. It cuts through the weeds, it aerates the soil, and now I can plant right inside. Look at this. See how it's chopping all those weeds up? That's all that I need to do. And now look at this soil soft, ready to plant, aerated, so my, my, uh, the roots are gonna be able to take root. $79.95, it comes with a, a lifetime warranty. I'm gonna, it even stands on the ground when you stab it in. I'm gonna get out of here because I am right smack dab in the middle of the sunshine and I'll start sweating again. Uh, Carrie Mobley, who I keep saying goodbye to, is back again. That's okay, I'm so happy to see you again. Carrie, a lifetime warranty, this, this is a tool every gardener should have. Oh yeah, I mean, lifetime warranty made in the USA. This is gonna be the last cultivator you'll ever buy. And just so you know what a cultivator is, is it's something that will prepare your property for cultivation, planting, seeding, weeding. Now, this is a really specific one that we have just for our HSN viewers, lightweight, solid steel, one inch thick ash wood that is coated. So what are you gonna do with this? Well, you're gonna cultivate, you're gonna weed, you're gonna aerate, you're gonna spot seed. You're gonna churn up your mulch so that you can refresh it without having to spend the additional dollars. I love to show this because with one hand in this solid rock, I am able to blast through this. Now my husband doesn't know this, but I have a brand new tree here that I am going to plant. And the way I'm gonna do it, I'm gonna break through this rock and then I'm gonna dig a hole. 
but I also have some weeds in here. Easy, easy. Because it's lightweight, you guys, you can see how it just breaks those. I mean, this is not even a joke. This is crazy, and I'm doing it with one hand. But like I mentioned, we've got mulch, right? Mulch is heavy. Mulch is expensive. So here, I can easily just refresh it. I mean, the bottom side of your mulch is still pretty. All you have to do is turn it around. Here is the secret to this product. We have these two spider tines solid steel, right? And you can see that they're inverted. Now we do that so that it can be multifunctional. If you want to use this to edge, or if you have some weeds that are in a smaller section, you just put it this way. If you want a wider section to edge or to weed, you can flip it this way. But it's the quality of the construction. It's the lifetime guarantee on this. Lifetime. Solid steel and solid ash. This is something that will be passed down for generations. And if you only get this to spot seed your grass, you are going to love it. Now, like I mentioned, we made this specifically for you, our HSN viewer. Lighter weight, but easy to use. It digs when you push forward and it lifts when you pull back. This is great rolling action for older folks, right? And we also know that kids love it. It's fun to play with because it's lightweight, but it's the quality construction that matters. And I have to tell you, you know, one of the things that I love the most are the reviews that have come in um, from other locations who, you know, have sold this. My favorite was an older lady who is in one of those mobility chairs. She was so happy to, with one hand, cultivate yeah. her property. Because you don't need to have the normal, like, heavy hoe that yeah. goes in. Or the <laughs> twisting turning. Look at how light this is. I love it. But with a <clears throat> lifetime guarantee. I know yeah. me too, guy. Yeah. I swear, you guys, hey. you'll absolutely adore it. We only mm -hmm. We only have a few hundred left. That's it. So it's going quick. If you want yeah. to get it, $79.95. Yep. And as Carrie said, a lifetime warranty on this product. So you're going to have it forever. And you use it for all the things we talked about. Carrie, I, now I am going to say goodbye to you. And I, and I, I promise I won't bring you back. And I, won't, I, <laughs> I keep dissing her every time I say goodbye to her. Happy Easter, my dear. Happy Easter. So nice to see you all. You too, now love. I get to go and hang out with all my little Yay. babies. So they're all teenagers. Have so they're going to think that's weird. But that's enjoy okay. your greatest cultivating tool of all time. Thank you, darling. All right, if you'd like it, 749-937. All right, we've dedicated the end of our show to what I consider the best deal. One of the best, I mean, it's hard to beat the deal on the pressure washer, but I will tell you, if you want something decorative for your yard, I think our, one of our number one outdoor garden, garden decor items is our shimmering, sh shimmering chandelier. We've sold this every day for 40 bucks. Today, it is less than half price. A lot of people have already bought two and three of them. They make a great gift. I love them. They look like boutique lighting. You can use them indoors. You can use them outdoors out on your patio. Uh, they have a built-in LED light that comes on for four hours. Look at how pretty that is with all those mirrors and those glass, uh, those plexiglass shells. It sparkles at night. It blows in the wind. It makes a, a fluttering noise. It's absolutely beautiful. It is $20. I want to get Chad Allen right out, right away, because I want him to explain it. I've got one here behind me, underneath our patio. Look out, look at how it's just twinkling. Pat. Look at that. Chad, look. It looks great. It, it looks so great outside. I'm inside. I'm not going to, I don't want to have any sweat stains like Guy. Thank okay. you very much. Thank you so much. You know what? I said after three hours, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to have to do all the talking. He's not going to have a voice. <laughs> and I've been watching the Facebook page for you. Kathy O'Leary. She already has six of them at her house, guy. Six of them, and she's picking up more because even she was writing to the other ladies, best price I've ever seen. So our Facebook ladies, they know what they're doing. All right, so here's what it is. The Georgia Brown GB Home and Garden Color Changing Shimmering Chandelier. It's a lot of words. What does it mean? It just means it's an indoor, outdoor chandelier. You can put it anywhere. It's battery operated. It's not solar, so it doesn't have to be in the sun to charge up. Three AAA batteries go right in the top. By the way, those are in your box. You don't even have to buy them. The batteries are included. And then it's a two-tier chandelier with springs around each of those rings. What does that mean? Well, each of these strands, 
Well, if the wind came and knocked it over, they'd fall all to one side, right? It'd be tangled, it'd be a mess. But with those springs, it holds each of these in place. So when you put it back down, it goes right back to the way when you set it up. In fact, when you get it home, I'm gonna just be really rough with this one for a second. It's gonna be all flat packed in a box and you're gonna go, oh, what a mess. Open the box and just pull it out. It falls into place. Each one is perfectly hand placed exactly where it's always going to be. You don't have to worry about anything. It's a twist top lid. If you bought one a couple of years ago, remember it had little screws and a little screwdriver. And you know, if you had dexterity issues, it was a little hard. Now it's just a twist top lid. The batteries go on the inside and then there's a switch on the inside. That switch is a smart timer. So when you turn it on the first time, it stays on for four hours and then it goes off for 20. The only mistake you can make with our chandeliers is only picking up one because as you're gonna see in the video, some of these longer dining tables, entryways, patios, if you had two, if you spent 40 bucks, oh my goodness, 40 bucks. I mean, you could really imagine the impact you can make without having to hire an electrician, without having to getting on a stud finder. But Guy Yovan, you know what this really does? It's a project you can do yourself. It yeah. gives you back your independence. You don't have to call anybody. This is a way for you to put lighting where you want it without any help. I love the fact that we have it displayed in a variety of ways. So you can hang it from a little hook on a, on a lamppost. You can hang it from a, from a fishing line with just a little, uh, you know, little S hook or a little I hook. Uh, it comes completely assembled. It's so cool when you get it in the package, you open the box and all you have to do is you literally, you, you lift it out and the whole thing comes to life. It's so cool. I love to, to Chad's point, I don't have to worry about ever messing with it, or, you know, or monkeying with it once I have it up because it automatically turns on at the same time every day. So if you set it at, let's say you set it at eight o'clock, automatically turns off at midnight. It's LED, the batteries are probably lasting the entire summer, right, the whole season. And then the next night, it automatically turns on again. I, <coughs> excuse me. I love it for a little girl's room, little boy's room, right? They want something cool. What about a powder room where you just want to add a little bit, a little decor for a special occasion? How about outside on your patio, maybe near your pool area, all right? Uh, you've got a little settee outside that has a couple of chairs and a table. What a great place to have morning coffee or glass of wine. And I am telling you, and I totally agree with Chad, at this price, at over half off, what was the original price, 44? At over 50% off, Buy as many as you can. This makes a great gift. And I like, Chad, too, that it's not seasonal. I would use, this is year round. It'd be great in the holiday season, correct? Yo, oh, my goodness, yes. Today's Easter. Actually, yeah. um, after this presentation, Guy, I'm heading out to my boyfriend's house. His mom, Kim, I'm gonna bring her one because she loved it from this morning presentation. I said, I'll bring you one this afternoon. Happy Easter, right? And that's the kind of gift you can give because that $20 price point doesn't break the bank and it makes somebody happy. So if you have a neighbor or maybe a lady down the street, you know she loves to garden. This is that perfect gift for anybody. Um, I'd be remiss in my job if I don't give you a once over of the whole item again, right? Yeah. So it's a two tier construction, springs around the edges. Those springs are extremely brilliant and important, although they're simple. It keeps all these strands in place, okay? All this is already assembled for you. You don't have to do anything. I just explain it so you know why we made the choices we made. And so if the wind came and knocked it over, if it's out in your garden, knocks it off the shepherd's hook, I'm making the bad weather situation up. All these strands would fall to one place. You'd be miserable to be tangled. These springs, they stop all that. Everything stays exactly where you want it. Now on the inside, past the two tiers of those blue turquoise shells and reflective mirrors in the inside, that's the two LED globes. And I'll show you here. I'll put one on each of my hands. Let's not forget I'm in Tampa. It's a little bright today, okay? Yeah. One on each of my hands, there's an LED globe, okay? That's what the batteries are powering. Batteries are in your box. You just look for them. You don't have to, you just have to pop them in the top. You don't have to go buy any batteries. Those fall to the center, okay? So in the daylight, the sun hits all the reflective squares and it shines and shimmers all over the place. And then at night, as I pull that back, that's when those LED globes, that's when they shine from the inside out. And it sort of looks like two different, you could like a daytime chandelier and nighttime chandelier almost, but you really got to think of indoors also. The little girl's room, the band above your vanity where you get ready. Uh, there's been a couple of hosts here, uh, Helen Keeney, for example, she has a sh one of these above her bathtub because she loves oh, a yeah. chandelier in the bathtub. Yeah. Places where you can't have a, an outlet or a wiring or you don't want to spend hundreds of dollars for an electrician to install something. Sure. Guys, this is something you can do yourself. Get your garden up to par, right? You want to 
You want to take it seriously. I've been saying it for a lot of our items. A little glam yeah. makes you seem like a professional, like, totally. no, like, you, like you hired somebody to do it. Guys, yeah. everything's in the box. It's all included. Can, Just hang it up. Can you imagine, Chad, <laughs> like if you have a special occasion, like a wedding happening or, or oh, some yes. kind of a special party, get three or four of these. Imagine putting these over like the bride and the grooms, uh, you know, the, the, the table up, up front. I haven't been married in so long. I forgot what they call that, but I guess it would be the... the whatever, the <laughs> bridal party table, right? That's what they call it. Can you imagine having these hanging or putting them in a powder room? Or, or if you, maybe you've got your, uh, you know, your daughter's birthday and you're like, I wanna make it look really fun. Get four or five of these for a hundred bucks. You've completely changed the look of the party. These are a game changer when it comes to like the look that you're trying to, to, to put off when you have people come over, right? They'll be like, you know what they'll remember. Yeah, they might remember the food, but they're gonna be like, did you see those beautiful chandeliers that they had? Oh my gosh. They'll never think you spent 20 bucks each on them and there's nothing to do but hang them. They're completely assembled. Pop the batteries in, that's it. I, I mean, I'm just, it's, it's just this value is crazy. At, at over 50% over off, there they are at night. I mean, they're truly, uh, you guys saw it. I had one, remember the one I have on the corner of my, I actually hung it off the gutter on the corner of my deck and it actually matches my house. It's absolutely beautiful. And that was back when it was, I think it, we had it on sale for like $34.95. So I was getting, we had $10. We dropped the price to $19.95 today. You can see it behind me. In fact, I'll walk back here if you guys don't mind. We have the lights on. It's just sitting in the corner. We put this on a, on a string. Um, and you'll, I don't know if you guys, you might be able to get the shot. Yeah, we can. So we put it on a little piece of fishing line. And there's what, when Chad was talking about the lights, I'll open up the little door there. And I'll show you, there's the lights. And you can see they're color changing put my hand in front of them so these are color changing that stays in the middle and then look at how beautiful this is i mean it's just a perfect way to fill up a corner look at that look at that shot that is gorgeous look at the sparkle so you're going to get to do this as well and where you put it is up to you it doesn't have to be the main light if you're putting it in a room it could just be the accent light okay it's very boutique it's very shishi it's very artistic but for $20, that's why people, I tell you, Chad, that's why people are buying four or five of them right now. That's what they're doing. Yeah. Kathy O'Leary on Facebook, she already owns six. She already has six at her house, and she recognizes how good of a deal it is, so she's going to buy some more just in case. That's the thing. We all talk about those $20 price points. That's the amount of money that I think we all sort of feel comfortable. The lady down the street, the aunt, the niece, you know, it's somebody who you know would enjoy it. It's just a nice little thank you or a pick-me-up gift. Uh, okay, as we close up the presentation, and maybe you're just joining us, this comes to you fully assembled. It's the number one question I always get. You don't have to do a thing. It's going to come to you like this, all flat-packed in a box, okay? You don't have to be delicate. This is not a delicate kind of item. It's meant to be outside. You take it out of the box. It falls just like that. The batteries are in your box. They're just separated a little bit. You just pop them right into the top which by the way is a twist top lid. You don't have to have any little screwdrivers or take out any little screws, no tools at all, okay? Pop those batteries in, turn that switch on when you want it to come on every single night because that's the brilliant thing. It's a smart timer, it auto regulates. It's gonna come on for four hours, <clears throat> then shut off for 20 all by itself. You don't ever have to touch that switch again. All you need is a little nail or a hook or something under a tree branch, you name it. You could put this basically anywhere. What you don't need is an electrician, is an outlet. Yeah. You don't even need the sun. Guy, a lot of our, some of our things we've presented, you need to, you know, put it in the sunlight so it can charge up, et cetera, et cetera. You don't need that. That shady corner behind your rocking chair there, it doesn't get very much sun. You don't have to worry about that. This is the item for places exactly like that, guy. Well, I'll tell you, for this price, and, and you know, we, we often tell people it's not really meant for like outdoors. Hey, guess what? It's, tw it's 19.95, it's yours. You wanna put it out in a tree in the yard? Go right ahead. <laughs> I'm just saying. <laughs> you know what I mean though, Chad? It's like, if you wanna decorate for an outdoor party, put it outside. Hang them from trees. You know, if you've got having a pool party, put it out there, have fun. It's, it's the, the sale price is ridiculous. That's why if you're looking, see our counter is jumping multiples. People are buying two, three of these because they're like, you know what? I know, I probably know somebody that would love this as a gift, be a great anniversary gift, a great girlfriend gift, a, a great boyfriend gift, whatever. You will absolutely love this. We're almost out of time. If you want it, it is 599. 
977, that's our item number. You can see I've got one behind me. We have one over here as well. You can literally put them anywhere uh, and there's no assembly. Take it out of the box, hang it up. That's all that you need to do. Uh, so grab it while you can. Chad Allen, thank you, buddy. Thanks, guys. It's been great. Happy Easter, everybody. Yeah, you too, bro. Have a great Easter. All right, so we have just about a minute left. Now, remember the question that I asked? Should I get up and walk over there? I'm trying to stay in the shade and the air conditioning. Look how dry my shirt is now, though. It dry Yay! It dry I made it through the hole. I'm not going to lift my arms because I don't want to gross everybody out. But anyway, the question that we asked was, what's your most hated bug? It's actually Gigi's question. Gigi's right over there. She's so, Gigi, I couldn't do the show without Gigi or all these guys and gals. But anyway, so the question was, what's your most hated bug? All right, this is from Dora A. Dora, you're going to win $25. She said, this will be my first Dynatrap. Good for you. Uh, I, I had one of the Zapper ones, but it broke in a month. She ordered the Bronze DS. Guess what her first bug was? You know what it is. Mosquitoes! All right, congratulations, Dora. Enjoy your $25. Uh, all you out there, uh, you have a wonderful Easter. Be safe, be happy. I will see you again a little bit later in the week. Uh, so enjoy. Bye, everybody.